Hi, I'm Mike. And I'm John. And we are back at the Rockwest Lab because I have a couple questions for John over here. Um, I know Rockwest can build a ton of filament wound tubes ranging from you know one inch, one and a half inch, mm -hmm. all the way up to two feet in diameter. Right. right. I know we have a ton in stock, but say I wanted to build a custom, maybe a 12 inch diameter filament tube that was 25 feet long. Right. Can we do that? Yeah, we can do that. We have our build your own tube website where you can actually put in the parameters that you want. We'll demonstrate it so it's pretty simple. You just tell us how big the inside diameter is how thick the wall, wall thickness is, and we can tell how long it is, up to certain lengths, and it will calculate a price for you instantly. We have about 30 mandrels to choose from right now. We'll hop on the website and uh, walk through the process. All right, let's do this. All right, John, so we're on the Rockwest homepage. Right. So all we have to do is, uh, right here from the homepage, we have a button, build your own tube. Super easy. That brings us to uh, the build your own tube calculator. Oh wow, so let's say, uh, for instance, I want to build a 12-inch uh, diameter tube. Okay, I'm assuming you want a 12-inch ID. We scroll down to 12 inches. All right. And you'll notice it has a maximum length listed here. Well, perfect, so I need this tube to be nine feet long. Nine feet, so yep. how many inches is that? Uh, 108. 108, okay. Uh, so we punch that in there. We also have a wall thickness requirement, so how thick do you want it to be? I want this one to be 1 16th. A sixteenth, so yeah. that's 0 .0625. And you'll notice that we have some parameters in here. We can't go below 40 thousandths with filament winding. We also have a material selector, so we can choose carbon fiber or fiberglass. Definitely fiberglass for this one. Okay. And then we have our key characteristics, whether it's bending, torque, or internal pressure, and that will determine how the part is manufactured. So bending is definitely more important for me on this one. Okay, so those are the five parameters that we want to input. Okay. We hit calculate, and it gives us a price. That's it. And that's it. We also have some other information on the side here that'll tell us how heavy the tube will be, the calculated weight, what the uh, key characteristics are. You can uh, also tell us how much, you know, what the resin content is and everything like that, the density. This is perfect. I actually heard a rumor that a guy named John Kimball programmed this. <laughs> so one of the things you can do with this, though, is that you can change your parameters. Yeah. If you want to go in and say, I want a carbon fiber tube that's the same length, I can change that parameter, hit calculate, and it recalculates everything uh, as well as the price. In carbon? In carbon. Yeah, that's excellent. We can change the length, we can change the wall thickness. You can do whatever you want. So John, so typically how long would it take to uh, build a part like this? Well, it depends on the quantity and it depends on the size and it depends on the schedule that we have right now. Okay. So it could be as little as two weeks or it could be as long as seven to eight weeks depending on what you really want right. and, and how many you want. Okay, it's all quantity dependent. It's all quantity dependent. Hey John, this is a super uh, simple tool to use. Uh, thanks for showing me. No problem. All right.